in our previous sessions we understood what is encapsulation and uh, how to protect the data using public private and uh, protected access specifier right but we understood that private access specifier cannot be accessed outside the class it can be accessed only within the class see what i want you to understand is as a developers we find out the way like how exactly which is not possible to make it possible I mean to say that even though the private members are not accessible outside the class, we'll search for is there a way to access the private variable even though it's a private. Yes, there is a solution through a method called as getter and setter. What do you mean by getter and setter? See, I told you that we have a balance method here. We have balance attribute. This balance attribute or the balance data is not accessible outside the class. Yes, we know that we got an error previously. But if I want, if I want to access this balance variable outside the class, is there a way how to do that i'll define something called as df i say def then i say get balance i'll create something called as get balance okay then i create a return self dot double underscore balance let me check this now i create an object of bank and i say b dot display details so account number balance everything is zero as of now okay now we'll create other bank and other bank is inheriting bank okay so now i'll create an object of other bank okay when i create an object of other bank here we get an error right so when i usually do this i'll be getting an error it says see boss this self dot balance what we have is not accessible correct i agree because uh, self dot balance whatever we have the self dot balance is having something called as a, um, a private variable it is accessing the private variable of a uh, uh, bank so it is not accessible let me run and show you once again for you so i'll just do this i'm trying to access the self dot balance i mean trying to access the balance it says account number okay fine it is accessible because it is protected but this balance what you're trying to access no it is a it is not accessible basically because it is a private variable so we find or we i told you there's a way to do it so what we did was what we did was we access we uh, wrote a function called as get balance okay when i run this okay it says uh, it is written in the balance now let me try to do in a different way now what i do is i say o dot get balance mm, sorry for that usually we have to maintain a camel case for functions because first letter of the function must be small the first word and the second word the first letter has to be capital this is what we maintain it's not a it's not, it's not error but usually we maintain few standards while developing right so we maintain that okay fine so o dot get balance i'm asking since o dot get balance is returning some variable i say i'll put it in a variable called bal bal is equal to then i say print bal Get balance is exiting self. I run now. Can you just see here? We are able to access the balance variable even though it is a private. Even though it's a private, we are able to access because I return one more function called as get balance. Oh, I mean to say that whenever we have a variable which is private, we can't access it privately provided. If it's a private variable, it can't access it directly, provided we can access it through the functions, through get function. That is, we call it as a get and getter and setter. It's not that we have to give a get balance itself. No, the, I mean, it can be get balance or get balance, whatever you want, you can put. That is not a problem. But I'm trying to access the variable which is private outside the class. Even though it is private, I'm trying to access outside the class. We can access outside the class through the functions it actually makes sense right because when when i'm able to create an object of a class i must be able to get all the variables and all the functions of the class yes the compiler says the programming says yes it's possible but don't access it directly create an object there's some function called as get function through that get function you can access the variable this is a standard what we always maintain whenever you create an application you can't access the variables directly we always write functions called as getter and setter it is very very important guys very very important whenever we write any application we are not supposed to access the variables directly it's always it's always good to access the variables through the functions which function the getter functions if you want to set a value if you want to change a value let me say that your balance is now zero 
right? I want to set the balance. I can write one more function called as b of set balance. Okay, I can write set balance. And I accept the balance here. I say CLF, then bal. Okay. Then I say self dot balance is equal to bal. Okay. Now I have set balance function. I created. Now uh, I create another bank. Then I say I'll set now. I'll say uh, O dot set balance. Right. Set balance. Then I'll set it for 9000. Let me say. Okay, no, it's already 9,000. It says 9,500. Okay, then uh, I'll try to access once again. I'll try to access once again. See, private member, not only we are getting it, we are trying to change also. That's the beauty of programming, right? So again, I'll say bal1. This was bal, this was bal1. I'll print bal1. Let me say, let me check how it works. See, it got updated. So we can access the private variable, we can set the private variable and we can access the private variable but not directly through the function. So we always prefer you people to write the getter and setter functions for the variable. Whatever the variables we have, see I just wrote for balance but it's always good to write the getters and setters for all the variables. This is standard what we usually maintain and what I wanted you to understand is even though the variables are private, we will be able to access those private variables not directly through the functions the beauty of programming this is the most important topic which might be used in most of the cases when you're doing the project or it might be asked in interviews also just remain about this okay so answer is if can't we access the private variables usually it can't be accessed that is the reason we make it as private but even though you want to make it accessible you can define a function called getter and setter okay this is all about the total the complete concept of encapsulation the getter the setter methods and the access specifiers I want people to revisit the videos, run the files, create your own applications, own examples, and practice as well. Thank you.